Well, I knew how tough it would be. I knew they'd, they'd you know, yesterday the pins were kind of in the middle of the greens, and I knew they'd stretch it out a little bit and uh, kind of tuck some pins. So it was just trying to be patient and just go along what I was doing yesterday. Seven, I hit it in the rough uh, off the tee, and I laid up, and I hit a good wedge to about 12 feet and made that. And then uh, eight, I hit a good drive, and I came off a three hybrid and hit it in that front bunker to the right, and I had a beautiful bunker shot to about a foot and a half. And then nine, I hit a nice eight iron to about two feet. And then going to the back nine, the wind really started blowing. I had no idea what I was doing until I think I looked at my phone on 16 and saw that I was actually one shot back. So I was like, then I just had bogeyed 15. So I just tried to stay as patient as possible because this is a golf course where you really need to kind of pick your spots when you're going to be aggressive. 13, I hit, a, I hit a good drive, you know, and I had like 260. And I mean, that green, just try to get it up near the green. You know, I knew those guys were laying up. My play was just to try to get it up as close to that green. I hit a good shot, I just pushed it a little bit, but I hit an absolutely the perfect spot. I mean, that bunker with a little uphill lie, couldn't have it any easier. It's always nice to win, you don't win all the time. And, um, you know, anything met, I say it all the time, met, met's the greatest. And uh, with all the, you know, you look down the list at all the players, all the great players, and to come out on top is very special.